Okay, the um, first step of creating this package is we need to create a, um, a data flow task, which as I've sort of described is sort of an envelope, which contains all of uh, this, uh, this package, in particular, in primary this, um, this, trans uh, this pivot transformation. So we're going to pull data in from an Excel data source. So we're going to click on the Excel data source. We're going to say it's a new connection manager. Now we'll point the connection manager to where the file is. So that is the unpivoted data I showed you before. Click OK. Now it'll look for the sheet, pivoted data. Now look at the columns. That's all looking pretty good. Now I'll say preview this. Sometimes I have errors. OK, that's looking OK. So you've got the customer appearing multiple times um, with the various products I've purchased. OK, so that is the um, is the connection manager. So the connection manager has been, been put down here. So the important thing which you need to do at a um, sort transformation first, uh, the inputs need to be sorted. I want to talk about the input, the actual what's going to be the row item needs to be sorted. So in, um, in our case we are going to, the row item is going to be the customer name. So we're going to go OK. So that looks pretty good. I'll just straighten that up. Now we go down and grab the pivot uh, transformation and we connect that up. Again, run this running a little bit slow just because I've got it running on a not a very powerful laptop. So then we double click on the pivot transformation and look at the input columns. So the, um, we've got the three um, three uh, columns there, so with the, the the names of the three columns. So we go, okay, that's one. All of those. Ignore the the error down there. Um, oh, yeah. Now we just double click on that again. Didn't need to click out of that. So that's the input column that I've just done. And now with the, you go to the input and output properties tab, and this is where it starts to get a little bit messy um, for these uh, for these settings. So what you need to do uh, pays to get a uh, pen and pen and paper here, um, so you can actually write down um, what these uh, what some of these settings are. So uh, what you do is click on the customer. Um, num first, then scroll down to the bottom. And what we're looking for here are um, are a couple of um, couple of um, columns here. So we're looking for the lineage ID, which is very important, and the pivot usage um, uh, setting here.